Well, we got plenty of sunshine today. It's a beautiful day out there right now. Picture perfect. A yeah. nice uh, afternoon. We had that fog around in spots this morning, but ooh la la, let's go outside. I like that. Yeah, I like this weather. Live look at the Magic City. Crystal clear. High pressures in control. Let's bring in the numbers. Right now, Tuscaloosa, you're up to 67. Birmingham, a pair of sixes on the thermometer, a very light east northeast wind at eight miles an hour. Gadsden, good afternoon to you. 64, our average high PS for this time of year is 65. And most areas are already well above the mark of 65 degrees. Coleman, you're headed in that direction. 62 right now, 66. Good afternoon to you in Double Springs and 68 right now on the thermometer in Hamilton. Storm track radar, the sweep comes back clean. Oh me, oh my, that was not the story yesterday afternoon. Showers and storms with the cold front that uh, pushed through early this morning. Well to our south, high pressure building in. The tail end of this front is stalling and this combined with another cold front to the north will bring in our next chance for some rainfall. And I know the weekend is almost here. And unfortunately, at this point in time, it looks like the rain will be back as we kick off the weekend. All right, first things first, let's get through today's forecast. Temperatures top out in the lower 70s overnight into tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. Not as cold as it was earlier this morning, 47, give or take a couple of degrees. Notice the clouds building back off across parts of Texas and Louisiana, lifting to the north, gradually pushing to the east. It's going to be warm tomorrow afternoon, mid 70s. Early on Friday morning, that cold front approaches showers and a few storms out ahead of it. A better chance of rain as we get into Saturday. All right, so here we go for today. A bright blue sky, high temperatures top out in the lower 70s, even warmer tomorrow. The rain creeps back late Friday into Saturday turning cooler on Sunday. Jamie. All right, Michael, thank you.